Ooh, hey everybody, Angry Pons here, continuing to play Metroid Prime, and it's time to finish off Metroid Prime. Chase after him into the hole here. You actually have a second there to catch your thoughts before you go into the next portion of the fight. There's his carapace. Now we see Metroid Prime's two true face. I'm scanning it. <laughs> oh, god, that's scary. Look at that. Metroid Prime, the core essence of Metroid Prime. The scan indicates that Phazon Energy Life on Metroid Prime is invulnerable to all conventional weapons. Only attacks from the Phazon fused arm can enable damage. Damage it. It generates pools, pools of Phazon when it attacks. Use these to fuel your suit's Phazon weapon system. The entity can spawn Metroids to assist it in battle, rendering itself invisible when it does so. Yeah, we're just gonna wanna get out of any beam, it doesn't matter which. Wow, avoid that thing that he does when he when he drops stuff on the on the he does that jumping thing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm, you guys probably don't know what the hell I'm talking about. When he does that move just there, where he sort of uh like charges up and then drops it down like that. Alright, he's creating a pool of Phazon. That means he's gonna go into a uh, cloaked mode. And what we need to do is get over to the pool of Phazon, get out our thermal visor, and by stepping into it, we'll activate the Phazon beam. Yeah, avoid that. It'll knock you out of the pool. Where's Metroid Prime? He's right over there, isn't he? Come on, I just saw him. I'm going into x ray. There he is. Alright, where's the pool? Where's the pool? Am I in it? No, it's right there. Crap. Get out of here, dude. You're in my pool. Ah, and you just stand in the pool? You fire at him like that. Crap. Where's the Hazon pool? I missed it. Does that count? It doesn't count, does it? Alright, he's creating a new one. I'm going into the X-ray visor and try this again. Where'd he go? 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 See, I'm looking for that attack to come back again. Is he right above me? Where the hell are you, dude? Yeah, sometimes he's only, you, only, you only can find him with one visor. And then you go just tap the A button once you're in the pool of Phazon. And you can just zap the hell out of him and do a good bit of damage, too. Now I'm going to go back to my normal visor so I can look for the uh, next pool. This is the easiest visor to find him in. And again, jumping a lot to avoid that thing. Alright, he's over there. So I'm looking for the pool. There it goes. Alright, I'm going to guess thermal this time. Yeah, he's thermal. Where's he at? No, oh, he went X-ray just a bit, didn't he? Crap, where are you at, dude? Alright, I know he's around. There he- oh, he's in normal visor. Ah, ha, ha, ha. We just zapped the hell out of him. Whenever it says hyper mode, it lets you know that you're actually in a uh, pool of Phazon. That's how you know that you're in the right place. But yeah, he's gonna keep jumping from uh, visible in the visible spectrum, to visible in X-ray, to visible in uh, infrared. So you're going to have to keep jumping around with your different visors in order to find him. Alright, he's making another pool of phase on. Let's see if I can... Crap, he's uh, got Metroids going after us now, too. If you lock onto a Metroid, you can destroy him in a single shot. Crap, use a power beam to get rid of him. So you don't want to have to deal with those guys while you're fighting Metroid Prime. Alright, where the heck is he? There he goes. Sometimes you just pick the right visor and you find him and zap the hell out of him. And that, uh, using the Phazon Beam will actually reduce the amount of Phazon in the pool. Which, you know, is he visible in the spectrum again? Why can't I find him? He's right over there, apparently. Alright, oh, he's X-Ray again. Oh, he just changed. He makes a sound when he changes, it seems like. Keep zapping. Ah, crap, more Metroids going after us. Drop another power bomb on him. I can't see anything. <laughs> it feels so good just to see him like rip like that. Like, oh crap, you're hurting me. Alright, he's down to a third of health. Yeah, really jump over that. What the spectrum is he in now? Okay, why can't I find him? <laughs> I think sometimes he just goes completely invisible. You can't find him in anything. Alright, there he goes. It's like, alright, create another phase on pool already. Come on. We know you want to. 
And again, double jump is required to get over that move effectively. Is he doing it? Is he? He's changing. All right, he's back out here. And when he's visible in this spectrum, it's not like you can see him in all of them. You can only see him in this one. He's only ever visible in one of the times. Come on, dude. Make some more phase on so we can do damage to you. Wow. That attack will do almost half an energy tank worth of damage. That's where most of my damage is coming from right now. Although, I actually, uh, you don't get to heal between this part and the part before. And I actually came into, like, the Metroid Prime Part 1 missing, like, an energy tank and a half, so... Really, I've only taken, like, 600 hit. Alright, I'd love to see you to spawn some more phase on right now. That'd be amazing. You wanna do that for me, man? I'm just gonna stand here and wait, dude. Yeah, it helps, if he, it helps you get over that move if you actually double jump right towards him, too. Alright, is he gonna stay visible? Crap, get the hell away from me, you guys. I wanted to deal with you. Alright, where you at, dude? There he is. And we're in hyper mode. Just flick through those different visors until you, until you spot him off to the side there. And then immediately go for, uh, whichever, uh... Whatever, go for the pool, get into hyper mode, and do some damage to him. There he goes. So this thing in X-ray so I can see where he is. Makes it easier to jump over the stuff that he does. Come on, dude, go for it. You know you, you, know you want to make some more phase on him. Come on, man, you've only got one more go-around in you. You've got one more before you're done. Want just a note here? It doesn't matter what beam you've got out when you're standing in the pool. It'll automatically go to the phase on beam. You go into god mode. <laughs> Hyper mode, it says. That's awesome. Alright, there he goes. I think he might go thermal, I'm not sure. Let's look. But yeah, if you got those Metroids zopping around you like that, you can take him out like that. I think he's thermal now. Yep. Yeah! Bummer too, I want to put him in the visible spectrum. Come on, get in the pool. Yeah! Are you done? Are you done? We got him. We got him. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, what's happening? This doesn't look good. You piece of shit! He stole our Phazon suit! 